escape that'll get me. MJ, stay back. I don't want to have to rescue you too. Peter, don't be crazy. Wait for help. May! May! Here! We're over here! I got you. Hang on! Oh. Hey, man, you all right? Get to the window! <coughs> it's too far. Oh, hold on! Just brace yourselves! <coughs> Come on, you stupid piece of... Come on, May! I've got you! Oh my god! Go! Go! Uh. Miles! Come on! May okay? Everyone is safe. MJ, if it weren't for you and Miles, I would have been... As dead as I would have been the last eight and a half thousand times you saved me. Pretty sure I still owe you a few. <laughs> That's smart. <laughs> hey. I'm sorry I screwed things up. It's just... Hard being the one who always gets saved, you know? Sometimes I want to do the saving. I'm sorry I made you feel like you couldn't. Still partners? Always. Hey, uh, so I didn't know if, uh, you wanted sparkling or, or flat or spring or mountain spring. So I got one of each. Am I interrupting? No. Um, MJ, Ms. Watson, and I were just talking strategy. Strategy? That's right. The city is in danger. It needs our help. All of our help. All right, well, call the play, coach. Okay. Divide and conquer. Ms. Watson, we need an anti-serum for Devil's Breath. Oscorp's developing something, but there's no way they can keep it safe from Octavius and Lee. We need to find the cure and protect it. I'll chase down some leads. Miles, you need to be my eyes and ears at feast. Anything goes wrong, call me. We need to keep that place and the people there safe. All right, you got it. What are you gonna do? Gang of costume nut jobs is taking the city apart piece by piece. Time I return the favor. Hey, wait, um, how do I call you? I mean, do you have like a cell phone in your, in your po pockets or something? Ms. Watson can give you my number. Good luck, team. You have his number. Are you Spider-Man's girlfriend? That'd be so cool. If... <sighs> Come on, Sherlock. Show me what you got in this water smorgasbord.
city feels a little more under control. Miles is watching Feast, MJ is tracking a Devil's Breath cure. Time for me to focus on finding Otto, and stopping whatever he has planned. Yuri, we need to start tracking the big boys. Still no leads on Octavius? No, nothing. Forensics can't even do a sweep of Times Square. Everyone in that department but the intern is sick. I might be able to turn something up, let you know what I find. Forensics is having a hell of a time. News reports say this is where Otto released Devil's Breath. Might have left some residue I can track. Oscorp's modified CPF-1. Definitely Devil's Breath. Should be able to track the dispersal path now. Trail goes in a few directions. Need to find the right one. Good. Dead end. Vapor trail heads up that building. down into those vents. What was Otto doing up here? Should be a door or an access hatch around here. Well, this is moody. be some way to hit the lights. Let there be light. Whoa. Was I 
Otto using this as a staging ground? Chaos of the prison break would have been perfect cover to move in. Martin Lee. Can't believe this is the same man I knew at Feast. Looks like Otto recorded messages for his crew. Oh, Martin. When I first realized it was you targeting Osborne these past weeks, I was shocked and saddened. But then, as the situation evolved before my eyes, I felt... inspired. You took the bold steps I had always dreamed of, Martin, and you took them without hesitation. I am honored now to join you on this path towards true justice. Seems like Otto and Lee have more of a history than I thought. How long have they known each other? Otto's rage is driving him. The neural interface is exacerbating it, but his hate is genuine. He'll destroy the whole city to hurt Norman. collects his accolades, and keeps his boot heel pressed against my neck. Why can't anyone else see how selfish he is, how reckless, how evil? If only they could be made to see the Norman I know, the man behind the mask. Looks like Otto's been studying Sable's tech for weaknesses. Good old Rhino, my second favorite Russian. Alexei, I've followed your career with great interest. The world sees you as a witless dullard. I see a warrior with a poet's heart. I know you desire freedom from the battle suit you're sealed inside. Help me achieve my goals, and freedom shall be yours. Otto developed a corrosive to free Rhino from his suit. A certain government agency spent years trying and failing to do that. Only took Otto a few days. Mac Gargan. A.K.A. Scorpion, A.K.A. Crazy Pants McCrazy. It's rare for me to admit this, Mr. Gargan. Clearing your debts was more difficult than I anticipated. You are in arrears to some demanding individuals. But, once the reservoir job is finished, your financial obligations will be finished as well. Otto Octavius is nothing if not persuasive. Oh, 
old man Vulture. I've tangled with him more than anyone else here. Power source for Vulture's wings gave him spinal cancer. And Otto's developing an experimental treatment to save him. Electro. Total live wire, that one. Max, when you first conveyed your dream to me, I thought you insane. Pure energy. <laughs> but as I dove deeper into the problem, I discovered a way to give us both what we desire. I promise you, when we are done, you will be pure energy. Or so close to it as to make the difference irrelevant. Electro's big pipe dream is to become pure energy. Doc actually managed to modify his harness to get a little closer to that goal. What's this now? Otto must have used this map to plan, but it's blank. Unless there's something here I'm missing. UV bulb. Huh, nothing happened. Must be a way to get that lamp on. There we go. Hidden markings. Otto's tasked the villains to destroy Oscorp holdings throughout the city. He's trying to take apart Norman's empire piece by piece. Lee's going after the Devil's Breath anti-serum, using something called Icarus? What's Vulture doing in Times Square? I need to keep my guard up. Electro's disabling Oscorp power plants. Makes sense. Rhino's targeting Oscorp shoreline properties. Which is he hitting first? And why? Scorpion must be trying to poison the city's reservoir. Another Oscorp-owned property. Seems like the last stage of the plan is a direct assault on Oscorp. And most likely, Norman.
Icarus, this is it. Hello, Spider-Man. We've never been properly introduced. I'm o Otto Octavius. There is no Icarus, is there? No. Martin needs no assistance to secure the anti-serum. Icarus was a ruse to get you into position. Into position? Huh? to work for a man like Octavius. Backup plans for his backup plans. Hey, no. Are you okay? What's happening? <laughs> Traffic's rough. Listen, Lee's gunning for the anti-serum. We need to find Oscorp's Devil's Breath Lab before he does. On it right now. Pulling every building permit in the city. If there's a record of the lab, I'll find it. That's great. Okay. Uh, talk soon, MJ! Trap failed? Softened him up. Time for plan B. Heartwarming, Electro. You really grew in prison, didn't you? Not even close, Max. As usual. damage him if I web the transformer. Now's my chance. Keep his guards up. Keep his stunner surprise.
wants to break you. You got it! You got my joke! I'm so happy I can almost stop fighting! Almost! Gotta be honest, liked it better when you two were loners. Amazing what a little teamwork can achieve, ain't it? The of you, the wisdom of experience, a fine pairing! Just like oil and water, sure.
Should check on Sparky. You might have got the old man, but I'm gonna get you! Confidence, I like it. Unreasonable, unjustified, but still confident. Good on you. Electro's been grounded. Spider-Man, I presume. If you really cared about this city, you'd be helping me expose Osborn for the criminal he is. By killing innocent people? I would have restored the power. You're sick. You need help. I have all the help I need. And we will not stop until Norman gets what he deserves. when they team up. Just need to catch my breath. What time? Oh, man. Need to update Yuri. Yuri, Vulture and Electro are down. Four to go. I saw. Also noticed a rooftop in Times Square exploded. Wouldn't happen to be related, would it? Nothing gets by you. It was Octavius's staging ground. He's using the villains to pull apart Oscorp. Vulture and Electro were targeting power plants. Scorpion's going after water treatment. Not sure about Rhino yet. Something along the shoreline. That's good enough to start. I assume you're going after Scorpion? Yeah. City's already on the brink. If we lose clean water, we might never come back. I'll update you when I make progress. Sounds like a plan. I should check on Miles. Hey, Pete, you okay? That's what I was gonna ask you. I'm fine, but you and May are in the middle of it. We're busy, but people need help. And I'd rather be doing something than waiting around for somebody else to fix things, you know? Yeah, I heard that. Just make sure you protect yourself. Mask and gloves. And rest every now and then. While that goes double for May. <sighs> Nobody can make that woman take a break when she doesn't want to. But I'll do my best. Thanks, Miles. Give May my love. And be safe. Closer look. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. 
damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa! What the... Is that... a sea of poison? Can't be! This can't be real. Must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground, and analyze whatever he injected me with. Whoa! What the... Is that... a sea of poison? Can't be! This can't be real. Must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground, and analyze whatever he injected me with. Should be safe for a minute. We need to analyze the neurotoxin so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. Alba. Where'd it go? Is this real or in my mind? It can be both. It's just the hallucinations intensify. You can get through this. Doc? Y you sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind? My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! Ah, uh, Peter. Always trying to shoulder the risk. Even when there's no hope. 
I can't tell you how many times your unfettered optimism has kept me going when things look bleak. I'll miss being with you. I really will. I'm sorry, Doc. I'm so sorry. Yes, yes, I'm sorry. And yet, you let it happen. Makes one wonder where your priorities lie. I mean, if I was really that important to you, why would you let me destroy myself? I can help you! There's the Eclipdalb! I need an antitoxin to mix a permanent antidote. One of Harry's research stations was developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Giant deadly scorpion tails. Lovely. Thanks, brain. How you feel, Spider? Raw panic. Fine. Scorpion? How'd you get this number? Always asking the same interesting questions. It's not how am I calling you, it's am I calling you. Maybe I'm just the fevered screams of your dying. Real or no, when I cure this poison, I'm coming for you, Mac. <laughs> Big talk from the little bug. Have fun chasing pink elephant.
You're too late. Just as you were too late to help me. This isn't you, Doc. But it is me. The me polite society found inconvenient. The parts of myself I suppress. But you helped me break those chains. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear. Stop deluding yourself. You never help anyone. The poison isn't in. You are the poison. Everyone you touch suffers. Stop running from me. Let me try. I want nothing from you. You're a failure. And life, love, career, you bring nothing but pain. No, stop. I'm not giving up on you. Please, just talk to me. I can help you. So you can treat me like all the rest? Containing me? Suffocating me? No, I would let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter. A rat in my own lab. To think I called you a friend. I am your friend, Otto. Please! I've always supported you. I always will! Supported me by selling my ideas to Norman. By sabotaging my greatest works. Don't think I didn't see. Don't think I didn't know. Please, Doc. Please. I had such high hopes for you, Peter. Such lofty ambitions. You could have been a great scientist, but you lacked will, always scattered. Oh, there it is. The atropine. the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. Deal with it! And nearly cured. Sorry to bust up your plans. Oh, don't worry. This is the price is left for you. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. Count on it. I need to mix the antidote. Finally, the real lab. No more hallucinations. Working. Ah! 
get his guard down before I can hit him. That gave me an opening. Another hallucination. At least he had an imaginary glass jaw. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Bring it on! You're a loser! All you'll ever be is a loser! Can't let him get to me. Stand up. There's the centrifuge I need. Finally! I'm running out. I think I did it. Where'd my suit go? I think I took decontamination a little too far. I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Let's just go ahead and forget that ever happened. So many good memories of working here. Doc's the smartest man I know. And now he might be the most dangerous. It's still foggy. Need to work the last of this poison out of my system before I tackle the other villains. Good time to go on patrol.
MJ, hey, you mind if I toss a kind of thorny ethical question at you? When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh, wow, Pete. Thinking of Otto? That obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable, though. Man, the high-minded, generous part of me wants to say never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done, I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew was still in there or not. Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you. And that's why Jonah paid me the big bucks. Come on, Spidey, don't give up. We'll get the city back on its feet. Is it really you? Dude, it's really him! Ha! Get out of my sight, Spider-Man. You're ruining this thing. I need to get after Scorpion, but I haven't seen Aunt May face to face since the fire. I think I can afford a quick pit stop at Feast. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? 
I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Beth. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Hit him? Like a bug on a windshield. Splat. All because he made one stupid crack about the guy's suit. Freaking intense. You need to distract agents. him. Hacking apps should work. What was that? Time to move. Should be able to hop that wall. Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. You see the way he came through here? The guy's like an animal. Both of them are. Gosh. They're on our side. Iodine. But no antibiotics. I need to keep looking. You two, get over here. All right, all right, all right. Locations and schedules for your supply runs. More supplies over there. Need to get past these guys. Believe me, I hate watching Benson wail on them. Turns my stomach. Just give us the info. Stop. Don't have clearance for that. Oh, buddy. That's not what Benson wants to hear. Everybody. Stupid kid man! Must have been seeing things. Whoa! More supplies over there. Need to get past these guys. This can stop right now. Just give us the look. Locations and schedules for your supply routes. I don't have that information. Believe me, I hate watching Benson wail on them. Turns my stomach. Just give us the info and we'll stop. Clearance for that. Oh, that's not what Benson wants to hear. Stoop! Why are the Superdudes so set on taking out these relief centers? Something about Osborne. Can't they want to show how weak he is and he can't protect the city. <laughs> Sounds like a lot of drama. As long as they let us keep all the supplies we find, I don't care. Yeah, man. This stuff will be worth a fortune on the black market. Come on. Let's keep digging through it. It's been too long since I got... Stable guys give up the depot locations? Eventually, yeah. Now the big guy's taking the stations out all by himself. Dude's walking a bomb. It's that Russian blood, man. Makes him crazy. That's offensive. My grandma's Russian. Your grandma? 
Doesn't that mean you're Russian too? Another supply tent. Crossing a couple trauma kits, but no antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. Looks like they're gonna divvy up the supplies. Oh boy. You better not try short. Gotta us. avoid that sniper. Hey. Bro, relax. Everybody gets a take. Nobody's trying to short you. Dude, please don't embarrass me. Chill, please. I heard that. More supplies. Oh, come on, crate, be the one. Moxicillin. Perfect. This is a very large man. I found the exploding bulldozer. Supply roots and schedule. Now! Yes, Kazao! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is. inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! You did not need to see that. my exit.
Let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha, <laughs> kids right. got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. Jay, what's up? You okay? I'm fine. Coming through Oscorp records. Hey, this is random, but you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. Ten hour odyssey for burnt toast with cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. Just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no supervillains. We could throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cuz. Now it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, this adult thing is rough. I guess the work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. In safety. Kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza? <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete.
last up piece. Fire from stolen vehicles. Please proceed to Spanish Harlem. Over. That's a keeper. Is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, let's we'll put the team up. I thought you were a loner. Means and ends, folk. All of life is means and ends. Chats. 
You are funny, Malik. I am almost sorry to destroy your tiny face. Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Corpse, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I did the show? Beg him to give up? Yes, Gargan, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, oh, like an ordinary couple, you two! Again, Garkin. Keep talking to me. I'll take care of you after I finish the work. So you guys and Octavius, huh? You have a name yet? The Scary Six? The Dirty Half Dozen? How about the We Murder Spider Man and you two boys for a blanket? Hey, Garkin, please, you embarrass yourself. Getting his suit removed. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Money. Guardian has no princess. He fights for profit. Untrue. I ripped Spider-Man face off for free. The money. Now you know. I won't tell anybody. And leave your soul uncrushed. There is fun in that. Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show! might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Hey, I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? 
That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky. We need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Douglas, this is Sable Control. Boss wants an update on your status. Control, APC Tango pursuing escape prisoners. Electro trying to destroy our power grid. The Vulture raining death from above. Spider-Man egging them both on in the very heart of our city, roaring like children. Lethal children, pitching a tantrum of death and destruction. I'm often asked, why do menaces like this end up with awesome powers? Why not someone like you, Jonah? <laughs> well, I have considered trying to use advanced science to give me powers. Only so I could protect you in a more hands-on way, of course. But after much reflection, I've decided against it. Because power corrupts. I'm a man of the people. And I want to stay one of the hard-working, ordinary people of New York. So I'll just help via my talk show, my publishing empire, and my vast personal fortune. No need to thank me. It's what a man of the people does. All units, prisoners are opening fire from stolen vehicles. Additional officers report to Spanish Harlem. Love it. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. Okay. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! 
Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. He's got some fancy new system installed in the back security room. No sweeps needed, they say. Plus, you know, he's the mayor. What a jerk. He's definitely lost my vote. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember... Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Stand by, Control. I heard something. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Hmm. 
Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. The Fabulous Osborne Boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax in Bello. Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? The city's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. What a hero. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. A photo was removed, though. Wonder what was there. Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, 
I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry?
Harry's mom planted this when he was born. Looks like Norman has made a point of caring for it now that she's gone. Beautiful. Norman said the key is with M. I wonder if he meant that literally. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. be so carefree. I miss those days. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Tell us you were sick. Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room.
I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. something control stand by okay bingo hmm. we're all clear control got to find the location of the devil's breath norman osborne GR-27 research. GR-27 is a cure. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. Alpha team, stay alert. A child's x-ray. But it's not Harry or Emily. Who is this? That aura around him. Is this Martin Lee? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. Looks like a map of the Upper West Side. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Good old Alpha team. 
Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep Dr. Strom. Isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. No, I need to track Michaels. Van Adder is- Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. I had no idea they owned so much of New York. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Commercial buildings... Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. Good ol' Alpha Team. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Nice, got some overlap with Dr. Michael's path. No, Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti-serum in a shopping center. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it! Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it! Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Have a breach. High alert.
I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. lab location and a lot more how far away are you two avenues over say the word and i'm there great keep the motor running Need to clear that balcony. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman.
have to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon, I promise. <laughs> 